Hello guys and welcome back to TechWolf and to this Windows command prompt tutorial. In this video I'm going to show you how to write to file by using command prompt or cmd. In previous tutorial we created these two files by using our command prompt, myfile.txt, another is index.html and I'm going to show you how to write HTML code into HTML file and how to write a simple text into the text file. To do that let's open a command prompt, type in cmd in search and hit enter enter. This will open a command prompt. I am in my Marty directory. Let's go to our desktop. So we navigate to our desktop. Type in cd space and desktop and hit enter. See we are in our desktop and if I type in dir hit enter you will see all these files and folders here located here. So let's type in cls to clean this command line screen and now you know, let's write something to myfile.txt and to write to the file we type a command the same which we use to create create these files which is a command echo and space and then you can type something whatever you want into this file level right there hello world and space and then triangle bracket after this triangle bracket you put another space and specify the file name to which you would want to write in our scenario this is my file.txt and hit enter and we have written to our file and to check if we have written to this file we can right click on this file and you can open it in your text editor as I am using my default text editor notepad plus plus I will be opening it in on notepad plus plus click on open and you can see here we have written to this file and every time when you are writing or using this command echo to write to the file it will overwrite everything else what you have already written to this file and to check this we can go back to our command line and in our command line by using arrows up or down let's return to previous command which we have written which was echo hello world and here I will change this hello world to some other text I will type in some other text now we are echoing or writing to this file some other text and we are writing to myfile.txt and hit enter and now if we will go to our text editor here you will see that there have been changes, the file has been modified, we click on yes and we can see that we have written some other text to this file. So by using echo command whenever you are writing this way something to your file this will overwrite the text or the contents which was already by default on this particular file to which you are writing. But now I'm going to show you how you can write HTML code. For example if you would wish to write some code it could be HTML, it could be PHP or any other code where you need to escape triangle brackets. We do exactly the same way, type in echo space. Let's first write h1 tag if you are familiar with HTML and let's type in also hello world and exclamation mark and let's close this tag off. First we will echo h1 tag so space and triangle bracket and space and file name where we want to write to. In our scenario this is index html and hit enter and you will see that there was this very first error that closing triangle bracket was unexpected at this time and this is because html tags or any other tags in other programming languages these triangle opening and triangle closing tags they need to be escaped and to escape these tags let's hit an arrow up and before each of these triangle brackets at the very start let's put the escape tag and to enter the escape tab click on your keyboard shift hold it down and above six number six on your keyboard there is this escape tag so before each of these triangular brackets let's place this escape tag and before last one so it is escaping these triangular brackets and hit enter and as you can see now it doesn't return any errors so this means that this html code has been written to in index.html file and to check this we can also right click on the file and we can open this file also in some text editor I will choose another app and I will open it also in notepad plus plus and just once so you can see that we have written this HTML to this particular 
file. But if you would want to open this index.html file in a browser, we can also do that. I will move my browser here so you can see it. And we will open this file which is located index.html on our user smarty desktop. Let's open it in browser. And to open a file in browser, we type in a command start space and index.html and hit enter. And as you can see, now we have opened this file in our browser. Hello world. If I right click on this file and if I will click here on inspect, you can see that there is this code which we have written, which is hello world. Or you could check this code another way on this particular file. If you right click on it and you click on view page source, you will also see that this code which we have written to this file is also visible here in this page source of this particular HTML page which we have created and here similar way if you would be writing another code to this HTML file or to any file by using this echo command you would be overwriting all previous content which you have written to that file.